In the meantime, another big story today. Madison's fourth homicide this year happening on the city's west side tonight. Another man also critically injured in that afternoon shooting. News 3's Jess Garp live on the scene tonight. Witnesses and those who knew the victims, Jess, they're saying this dispute was some kind of financial situation? Well, yeah, News 3 has learned from some witnesses of this that they say this may have involved an unpaid debt. Police are not confirming that motive tonight, but they are saying that they are working quickly after shots fired reports came from this location. A huge police presence descended on Freeport Road just after noon after reports of a shooting with multiple victims. We've had two people who've been shot. Uh, one of those people who was shot is deceased. A 70 year old man was found dead in a body shop parking lot. A man in his 50s was rushed to the hospital in critical condition. A 52 year old man was taken immediately into custody by police. Neighbor Eugene Bennett says he knew all involved. You're right. They come over. They were customers. They stopped over him. He also says that the shooting happened after a financial dispute, a victim trying to settle a debt with the suspect. I think he got everything settled today. Police can't confirm that motive, but say they are interviewing the suspect be way premature for us to get into the reasons for why this violence took place. Uh, we've got a lot of detectives who are working on that. Police say they made an arrest and recovered a handgun within minutes of the 911 call, all because a patrol officer was nearby. Our officers were on this scene so quickly that everybody was contained and controlled, so there was no opportunity for flight. The Madison Police Violent Crimes Unit is handling the investigation of this case. At this point, there have been no names released on either the suspect or the victims. All right, Jessica, reporting on the west side. We'll have more tonight on News 3 at 10.